Blessings, 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 beloved. I am Mama Pam, a.k.a. Pamela Dobson, and I do read the word, beloved, seven minutes every day, so you do not have to read. <clears throat> we are resuming our read. I turn my ear off. We are resuming our read from Deuteronomy, the 32nd chapter, the 42nd verses, Deuteronomy, the 32nd chapter, the 42nd verses. It is Friday. November the 13th, 2020. We'll be reading from the King James Version of the Word of God. And uh, it's a song of Moses concluding and Moses sent to Mount Moab. Uh, Moses is getting ready to die, y'all, in a minute. Just keep on following the read. Reading from the King James Version of the Word of God, and it reads, And I will make mine arrows drunk with blood, and my sword shall devour flesh, and that with the blood of the slain and of the captives from the beginning of revenges upon the enemy. Rejoice, O ye nations, with his people, for he will avenge the blood of his servants, and will render vengeance to his adversaries, and will be merciful unto his land and to his people. And Moses came and spake all the words of this song in the ears of the people, he and Hosea the son of Nun. And Moses made an end of speaking all these words to all of Israel. And he said unto them, Set your hearts unto all the words which I testify among you this day, which ye shall command your children to observe to do all the words of this law. For it is not a vain thing for you, because it is your life. And through this thing ye shall prolong your days in the land whither ye go over Jordan to possess it. And the Lord spake unto Moses the selfsame day, saying, Get thee up unto this mount, mountain Abraham, unto Mount Nebo, which is in the land of Moab, that is over against Jericho. And behold, the land of Canaan, which I give unto the children of Israel for a possession. And die in the mount whither thou goest up, and be gathered unto thy people, as Aaron thy brother died in Mount Hor, and was gathered unto his people. Because ye trespassed against me among the children of Israel at the waters of Meribah, Meribah Kadesh, in the wilderness of Zen, because ye sanctified me not in the midst of the children of Israel. Yet thou shalt see the land before thee, but thou shalt not go thither unto the land which I give the children of Israel. Chapter 33. And this is the blessing wherewith Moses, the man of God, blessed the children of Israel before his death. And he said, the Lord came from Sinai and rose up from Seir unto them. He shined forth from Mount Paran, and he came with ten thousands of saints from his right hand, went a fiery law for them. Yea, he loved the people. All his saints are in thy hand, and I set down at thy feet. Every one shall receive of thy words. Moses commanded us a law, even the inheritance of the congregation of Jacob. And he was king in Jeshurun when the heads of the people and the tribes of Israel were gathered together. Let Reuben live and not die, and let not his men be few. And this is the blessings of Judah. And he said, Hear, Lord, the voice of Judah, and bring unto his people. Let his hands be sufficient for him, and be thou and help to him from his enemies. And of Levi he said, Let the Thummim and the Urim be with thy holy one whom thou didst prove at Massah, and with whom thou didst strive at the waters of Meribah, who said unto his father and to his mother, I have not seen him, neither did he according, neither did he acknowledge his brethren, nor knew he his own children, for they have observed thy word and kept thy covenant. They shall teach Jacob the judgments and Israel thy law. They shall put incense before thee and whole burnt sacrifice unto thine altar. Bless the Lord his substance, and accept the work of his hands. Smite through the loins of them that rise against him, and of them that hate him, that they rise not again. And of Benjamin, he said, The beloved of the Lord shall dwell in safety by him, and the Lord shall cover him all the day long, and he shall dwell between his shoulders. And of Joseph, he said, Blessed of the Lord be this land for the precious things of heaven, for the dew and for the deep that coucheth beneath, and for the precious fruits brought forth by the sun, and for the precious things brought forth, put forth but by the moon. 
and for the chief things of the ancient mountains, and for the precious things of the lasting hills, and for the precious things of the earth, and the fullness thereof, and for the good will of him that dwell in the bush. Let the blessing come upon the head of Joseph, and on the top of the head of him that was separated from his brethren. His glory is like the firstling of his bullock, and his horns are like the horns of unicorns. With them he shall push the people together to the ends of the earth, and they are the ten thousand of Ephraim. And they are the thousands of Manasseh and of Zebulon. He said, Rejoice, Zebulon, in thy going out, and Issachar in thy tents. They shall call the people unto the mountain. There they shall offer sacrifices of righteousness, for they shall suck of the abundance of the seas and of the treasures hid in the sand. And of Gad, he said, Blessed be he that enlargeth Gad. He dwelleth as a lion and teareth the arm with the crown of the head. And he proved the first part of himself, because there in a portion of the lawgiver was he seated, and he came with the heads of the people. He executed the justice of the Lord and his judgment with Israel. And of Dan, he said, Dan is a lion's whelp. He shall leap from Bashan. And of Naphtali, he said, O oh, Naphtali, satisfieth with favor and full with the blessings of the Lord. Possess thou the west and the south. And of Asher, he said, Let Asher be blessed with children. Let him be acceptable to his brethren, and let him dip his foot in oil. Thy shoes shall be iron and brass, and as thy days, so shall thy strength be. Now there is none like unto God of Jeshurun, who rideth upon the heaven in thy, in thy help, and in his excellency in, on the sky. The eternal God is thy refuge, and underneath are the everlasting arms. And he shall thrust out the enemy from before thee, and shall say, Be destroy them. Israel then shall dwell in safety alone. The fountain of Jacob shall be upon a land of corn and wine. Also his heavens shall drop down dew. Happy art thou, O Israel, who is like unto thee, O people, saved by the Lord, the shield of thy help. And who is the sword of excellency? And thine enemy shall be found liars unto thee, and thou shalt tread upon their high places. May the Lord add a blessing to you, the hearer and me, the reader of this precious and sacred word of God. We're going to stop right there. We had about 10 more seconds, but that's a good place to stop. We will resume on chapter 34. I want to say thank you for being a part of the Smurf Club for your continued support and donation of $20 to paypal.me forward slash Pamela Dobson, paypal.me forward slash Pamela Dobson, and or dollar sign Mama Pam 23, dollar sign Mama Pam 23. We are Smurf, the fastest growing ministry on the internet that I know. We broadcast across seven social media platforms. We broadcast across 16 social media platforms, Pacific Standard Time and 7 p.m. every evening, even though we are not live until the 1st of December. But right now we are broadcasting there. You see on Facebook, if you would go to Smurf, SMRF every evening or Pamela Dobson every evening, you will see these pre-recorded broadcasts on there. You can also review them at Pamela Dobson on YouTube. Go to YouTube, Pamela Dobson, subscribe and like so I can get to my thousand so they can pay me a little bit, a little something, something when I do my reads. Okay? <clears throat> if you say you don't want to donate, I ain't going to give you none of my money. That's okay. You don't have to give me none of your money. You can still support by ordering at one of these places, one through seven. You see the various places. Go to Melaleuca right now in this season. Melaleuca, M-E-L. A-L-E-U-C-A is tea tree oil. Every tea tree product is available. They're all natural products. Quit using that bleach and uh, pine, pine saw and last saw in your house and get you some Ameluca saw you guard. It'll kill everything. It's healthy. You can even swallow it. It's so good, but it kills all your germs. All right. Until the next broadcast, know that Jesus loves you. I love you too. And we live by faith and not in fear. God bless.